हेलो ऑल माय नेम इज क्रिश नायक एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल सो गाइस मेनी मेनी पीपल वर रिक्वेस्टिंग क्विकली कम अप विद द एआई इंजीनियर रोड मैप यू नो प्रॉब्ली इन एवरी वीडियो फ्रॉम द डे दैट आई हैव एक्चुअली अपलोडेड अ वीडियो अबाउट व्हाट डज एन एआई इंजीनियर डू यू नो एंड इन द कमेंट्स मेनी पीपल वर सेइंग क्रिश प्लीज गो एंड एंड अपलोड दिस एआई इंजीनियर रोड मैप कंप्लीट एआई इंजीनियर रोड मैप and uh, yes i it, it took me some amount of time because uh, i always provide you road map just not by saying you have to learn this or that i provide road map by providing you videos free videos complete course free videos along with that documentation link if i consider with respect to materials end to end projects everything is basically included in all this kind of road maps whatever road maps that you probably see let it be ml engineers data science data analyst i always make sure to do that you know now again uh, in this specific road map you will be completely seeing the ai engineer road map how you can actually become an ai engineers uh, along with this uh, there are multiple things that is basically included over here uh, don't worry about anything as such you don't even have to worry about materials handwritten notes also everything is available at one place you you will be able to find it everything in short right so let me quickly go ahead and share my screen as said uh, in my previous video i have already told you what does an ai engineer do and i have explained you completely over here we had kept a target of 1000 likes and 250 comments i think only 889 likes is done and to a, and somewhere around 66 comments is given please guys come on uh, if you really want to motivate me a lot definitely do that let's make this videos quite engaging because this videos are super important videos right where many people have made career transition it is completely for free my aim is always to democratize ai education like everybody should have that access to all this kind of videos or materials whenever they really want to prepare okay but yes just try your best hit like and uh, keep on seeing this entire road map okay now in this particular road map there are some amazing things that i have actually included uh Uh, you will be seeing as we go ahead you know so in this particular road map first of all always remember whenever you start a road map you really need to understand what does this specific role actually do right in this case i have actually created with respect to ai engineers so here is the video link the same video link what does an ai engineer do and you will be able to find out everything about it you know explained it in probably 18 minutes and previously also i have made a video but right now since generative ai is also becoming very much famous so everything is included over here second thing you have is ai engineer job description now always understand what does an ai engineer do first of all you really need to know and if you go ahead and click this you'll also be able to find out job description as i always said that most of the roles with respect to data scientist uh most of the roles with respect to data scientist ai engineers uh with respect to machine learning engineers in india specifically in startup companies you know things are overlapped like right? roles and responsibilities are mostly overlapped but if you really want to understand what are the kind of roles and responsibilities actually a ai engineer do try to see for a bigger product based companies and then you probably go ahead and see the job description okay and this job description i have already explained what all things you really need to have skill sets and all everything as such right so here you will be able to see terms like product management field engineering ux designer quality engineers you have to build a strong relationship and this is the most important word that is called as collaborate okay so both these links are specifically given over here to start preparing for this ai engineering role first of all you definitely need to know a programming language okay now you may be thinking krish is this the road map same like a data scientist no guys there are a lot of additional things that i have actually put over here as i said many of the roles many of the skill sets will be inter as an intersection okay will be very much common but there will be some more additional skills which i will be mentioning over here so overall this entire road map is of 6 months so the first thing that you really need to know is programming language that is python again right now python is the best no doubt probably in the upcoming decade just go with python programming language because there are multiple things that are coming in uh, with the help of python programming language if you see langchain as a web frame uh, as a framework to create llm application it has functionalities with respect to python or javascript right so all the apis that you'll be seeing all the libraries that you'll be seeing only with the help of python or javascript you'll be able to do it so just understand the importance of python like many people are using it many people are using to build even gen ai powered apps okay now with respect to python i have playlist in both my english and hindi channel uh, here you will be able to see all this entire playlist link you just need to go ahead and click it 
uh, as I said, this entire roadmap is for six months. So it is always good that you try to give somewhere around three to four hours daily. If you're giving three to four hours daily, no one can actually stop you. Okay, so here is your entire playlist. Then what is the final goal outcome after completing this Python playlist is basic to intermediate Python with various knowledge of various data structures like NumPy, Pandas, Matplotlib and many more. Knowledge of performing EDA, feature engineering, creating visualization charts using Python. At least make some Python projects using uh, frameworks such as Flask and deployment like web scrapping projects. So this in short actually helps you to create projects. It helps you to understand about how you can specifically use Python programming language in a real world scenario. Okay, and whenever new things in Python comes, please go ahead and check it out. Uh, it is always good idea with respect to that. After learning Python, obviously, we really need to learn about statistics. Statistics, whether you are a data scientist, whether you are a data analyst, whether you are a AI engineer, statistics is must. Again, with respect to statistics, I think I have everything uploaded both in Hindi playlist and uh, English playlist. I've also taken a live session. I think this will be more than sufficient. Because from all the people who have already made successful career transition, they have myself, they, they have actually given me a feedback crush. Your statistics video will be more than sufficient to answer any question in the interview. And this is from all the people who have already made transition. So if you, whether you're going for the interviews, whether you're going for anything, this many statistics video is more than sufficient. <clears throat> the best thing about statistics videos is that I have explained both descriptive and inferential statistics. And I have considered real world scenario and how we can use statistical concepts over there. So both with the help of theoretical knowledge and practical implementation, it is given in this specific playlist. Okay. Along with that, if you really want more, right? So I have put some links with respect to Khan Academy also. So Khan Academy, uh, uh, it had they have the portal. All the four courses are also free over there. So anything that is related to mathematics, like linear algebra, statistics, or differential equation, or integration, you can probably learn it from here. And I have given all the three links over here. Okay. <clears throat> so coming to the next thing, once you learn statistics, once you learn Python, now it is the time that you should know how to play with the data, right? So why we are learning this? I'll tell you just in some time, okay? It will completely make sense, okay? So here you have EDA live, EDA detailed playlist, then you have feature engineering, right? Live, uh, both live and complete detailed uh, feature engineering I have completed. Over here, what is the final goal and outcome? It is very much simple techniques to perform statistical analysis, familiar with all concepts, which will be important for machine learning, okay? Then coming to the databases, once you're probably completing this, I think this is very much common with respect to machine learning engineers, data scientists or anyone you probably go, okay? Databases, obviously, I always say that please go ahead with one SQL database and one NoSQL database. So here you have MongoDB, here you have MySQL, here you have Apache Cassandra database. Okay, so all these videos have also been uploaded. I've also shown you how you can integrate with Python code, how you can actually go ahead and insert your data. Everything is basically mentioned along with all my videos. Just imagine guys, 1900 plus videos is not a joke. All these videos are very meaningful videos. Trust me, if you're referring just to the, all this free content, anybody can make a transition. After you probably learn databases, now it's the time for machine learning. Now see, in machine learning, you have supervised and unsupervised machine learning. I think uh, uh, with respect to the playlist that I've created both in my English and Hindi channel, uh, it has garnered millions and millions of views, okay? Probably <laughs> millions and millions of views. You can go ahead and check this playlist. Every, every video has if I combine totally, if I combine, it is in millions of crores, right? I'll say, okay. So complete ML playlist in Hindi, live ML playlist, Hindi ML playlist, both supervised and unsupervised. Like what are the important machine learning algorithms like linear regression, uh, ridge, lasso, elastic, completely mathematical intuition, along with the explanation, along with practical implementation, everything is given over here. Not only that decision tree, random forest, XG boost, and then you have gradient boost all these things are covered similarly with respect to hindi also i've actually covered this unsupervised machine learning like came in clustering high mean db scan everything along with mathematical intuition and practical implementation everything is covered over here i don't think so you really need to go ahead and uh, probably see other resources this will be more than sufficient then coming to the deep learning playlist, as I said, machine learning, deep learning, I have completed one year back itself, all the videos. So here you'll be also able to see the specific deep learning playlist. Here I've focused on ANN, CNN, RNN, variants of RNN, like transformer, GRU, then you have uh, encoder, decoder, then you have LSTM, RNN, and uh, you also have techniques like uh, uh, 
uh, self attention attention is all you need then you have transformers then you have bird all these videos have also been uploaded with respect to deep learning and that is where nlp playlist is also coming nlp both in machine learning and deep learning i have covered both of them now why all these things are learned understand one thing because this techniques this whatever uh techniques or whatever terms i've used over here these are mostly used in the life cycle of a data science project whenever we consider a life cycle of a data science project we basically start from data ingestion to feature engineering data transformation then model training then model deployment after that monitoring will specifically happen if i consider till deep learning you can actually do the uh eda data transformation model training part till here right which models to specifically use how to check the model how to check the performance metrics everything is done till here right till nlp playlist then when we come to the deployments and here is what machine learning engineer roles also comes into existence okay as i said ai engineers will overlap in machine learning also machine learning engineers also data scientist also so important frameworks for production deployment like flask you have flask one shot video gradio framework bento ml flow and dax hub and if you really want to focus on apis then fast api is also there so all this kind of links and videos also i have actually put up with respect to there if you search for flash detail playlist just search with that name then you will be able to understand it now is the most important thing once you learn all these frameworks now you know how to probably do the deployment in the form of apis or how you to integrate with any software application let it be a web application or android right and that is where your ml ops will probably start now this ml ops the cycle that you specifically see in data science if you are, if you know about software engineering life cycle or software development life cycle we <clears throat> right now in the industry we use a process which is called as agile process and similarly in data science or uh, if i probably consider ai module life cycle software development life cycle there also we can specifically use agile process because agile process actually helps you to integrate the client feedback regularly because all the stories are divided into sprints now to understand how the stories are divided into sprints what is qa environment what is dev environment what is you at what is production all these environments also you should really need to understand because in ml ops we also create ci cd pipeline just to give you an idea if you really want to understand about software development life cycle and data science project development life cycle i've created one amazing video 18 minutes video here you'll be able to understand all these things what is sprints how when a project is basically started who is the first person that is involved like business analyst product manager when they do the requirement gathering how do they divide all the stories into sprints how the team planning is done how many developers we really need to consider you know based on that how many sprints we need to cover in uh, in uh, based on time uh, how many weeks specifically one sprint goes ahead with all these things you really need to understand because this is the bigger picture as a data scientist you'll just focus on that same thing right feature engineering eda data transformation model training right and once you create the model that is done but here as an ai engineer you really need to understand about the software development life cycle also and that is the reason i have created a video over here right so if you click this video everything i have explained completely from scratch okay now it is important you also need to know about machine learning operations because this is also must okay because at the end of the day once you create your model you need to do the deployment you are using a framework then you have to probably create github action ci cd pipeline circle ci you can also use circle ci to do the deployment q flow ml flow this actually manages the entire life cycle of a data science project deployment techniques you should know in aws azure gcp kubernetes what is evidently ai there are lot of open source monitoring tools right grafana is also there airflow to even to manage event scheduler bento ml aws sage maker how you can actually use it dvc data versioning control dockers there's so many things that i have already created in the form of videos i'm not saying saying that you should know at least each and everything at least github action ci cd pipeline ml flow if you know evidently ai to just understand that how the model is monitoring getting monitored aws sage maker dvc docker docker is in must if you pick up all this specific things then you will be able to understand how an end to end data science or ai project is specifically done in all my ai projects one amazing thing in my channel if you see all the ai projects i have always made sure that i have developed ai as a 
application itself otherwise as an api which can probably integrated in any kind of application so considering that once you probably complete this here are all the projects that i have actually created for you and the best thing about this particular project is that it includes machine learning projects deep learning projects natural language processing projects uh, computer vision projects ml ops projects ml flow projects so it includes almost everything not only that open ai project kidney disease classification computer vision project all the things it's it is basically included and this is what is the variety that i have actually given you right once you get this specific variety i think no one can stop you in doing or cracking any job interviews right now as you all know uh, generative ai is also becoming very popular so that is the reason i have also created roadmap to generative ai and along with this all the playlist i have created more than 100 150 videos right L updated langchain playlist uh, now this is important see as an ai engineer right uh, this thing you really need to understand whether an ai engineer see once that entire application is deployed right let's say it is in it is given in the form of api now that api needs to be consumed from web application from android app from desktop app multiple places right Similarly now since generative ai is very, becoming very form, uh, famous right now we have pre trained models we have foundation models now to solve our custom use cases we really need to fine tune all these models all this fine tuning process will also be done by an ai engineer and that is the reason here you can see that i have created updated player langchain playlist fine tuning it techniques in llm i have explained the entire thing like lora clora quantization what it is one bit llm what exactly it is everything is basically explained in this particular playlist then you have aws bedrock then you have llama index playlist google gemini playlist with projects langchain playlist which was the older one there were some other updates which i am probably uploading in this specific playlist itself right so this in turns co covers generative ai also and here you can see how much content i have actually given you guys i think uh, this much content if you are again i'm telling you unless only you don't devote time 3 to 4 hours trust me you won't be able to crack it but yes if you devote it trust me you have a lot of things to explain now this is also important which i have actually mentioned special mention good to have skills you really need to have some knowledge with respect to big data engineering or cloud engineering also why i'm saying you is that because in my previous project in my previous company uh, that is panasonic when i was working i had to communicate with the data engineering team iot team i had to communicate with the cloud team and at why i was actually doing that because we had created a model completely from scratch how to fine tune that model when I, how much new data is basically going to come from the iot itself how we are going to integrate with respect to uh, see from the cloud also we'll be getting some different data from iot devices also we'll be getting data big data team how they can actually combine it in the form of pipeline and store it in some kind of database and after that how can i probably accommodate those particular data and fine tune my model so all this needs to have a discussion so that is the reason why i am saying that you really need to have a good knowledge of big data engineering and cloud engineering i am not saying become an expert but at least what things are there what is there in the ecosystem you really need to understand okay So as usual once you probably complete this then are the internships you can apply in internships in this particular link along with that these are all my other links which you can also subscribe and support by taking amazing uh, support uh, support by joining my channel as a membership uh, it will definitely help me to create more this kind of videos but if i say this guys uh, this is a really amazing thing that i have done in the past 5 years you know people who are having issues with respect to money and all and here i have given so many different free things so that you can always learn at any point of time so i hope you like this particular video this was it for my side i'll see you all in the next video have a great day thank you and all take care bye bye